Red Etty here and today we're going to be looking at a really cool door design. Now this uses the concept that the hip box between nether brick fences and wooden fences, there's a gap between them if placed next to each other. So if we shift the, shift the fences upwards then it's quite cool because the fences hip box will change and you'll be able to walk through the centre. So as you can see, if we stand on this pressure plate, you'll be able to walk through the gap, run over to the other side, and quickly it will get pushed back into its original position. So, let's get on with looking at this redstone in more detail. So as you can see, if we strip this redstone down to the bare bones, you can see that it's fairly simple. We only have a piston, and then a piston on the top with a delay, so yeah, it's fairly simple. So let's get straight on with that tutorial. So to make this one, what you're going to want to do is have a five by one area and you're going to want to place a repeater here with a piston here. And then you're going to want to get some blocks. I'm very unorganized. And you're going to want to place a block of a piece of redstone just there and then a repeater here. And you're going to want that repeater to be running into a block with a redstone torch on the top and a block on top of the repeater, a block, or a floor block on top of the piston, and then another floor block on a diagonal to that one. And you're gonna wanna go up a couple of blocks and like this. And you're gonna go up to a time when it will be constantly, where if you place a block above it, to so where you have a, repeat, a redstone torch powered on, that may be a little bit too high. But you want to wear a red when you get to a redstone torch that's turned on, you want to place a block above it and a redstone torch on like that. So after you've done that, you can go ahead and place two blocks uh, out like this and repeaters on them both set to four ticks. And you can go ahead and place three blocks up like that and place a repeater facing down. So once you've done that, you can actually go ahead and fill in all of these. So you want these to be just going in like this, but you don't want them to touch the top block. And then you're actually gonna wanna join these up like that. So if we go ahead and place a button uh, right here, you'll see that it'll, it'll open up for you and then it'll shut automatically. So for if you want a circuit that will make it close automatically with piss, with uh, pressure plates, what you can do is place a repeater going into that set to two ticks and go ahead and do that on the other side. So repeater set to two ticks and then run this around like this. Redstone dust on all of those like that. And then place uh, sandstone on top of the redstone here and on the other side as well then you can place pressure plates there it'll open up and you can place your pressure plates on the other side so if you enjoyed this video guys please drop a like below and if you're new uh welcome to my channel and please subscribe thanks guys and i'll catch you guys next time